Hi, today we're going to talk about the Call Forward application, which is a phone app from Sangoma. Sangoma phone apps allow users to control functions and settings directly from the screen of their phone, so there's no need to remember feature codes or access the admin panel of the phone system to make simple changes. On a typical IP phone, if a user wants to forward calls to an alternate destination, they would need to type in a feature code, then type in the phone number to send the calls to. There are literally dozens of feature codes which control call forward settings, so it can be hard to remember them all. But the call forward application allows users to visually see their call forward settings, select between call forward numbers or enter a new number, all by navigating the phone's display. To get started, we're going to come up and push the call forward button. Now, as you can see, call forwarding is disabled. When most people use call forward, they have the calls going to the same places, such as their home, cell phone, or office. And those are stored under presets. As you can see, we have numbers stored for our home and cell phone. If you wanted to add one or change it, you'd highlight it, hit change, and then type in the number, and then hit done. We're not going to add that. Instead, we're going to go back to the home page of the application. So as you can see, call forwarding is disabled. With it highlighted, we're going to hit select. Now you have two options. You can either enter a number to have the calls forwarded to, or choose one of your presets. We're going to choose one of the presets. So with, with it highlighted, you're going to hit change. Now we're going to select the destination. So we're going to have all the calls forwarded to the cell phone. We hit select. As you noticed, the light went from green to red, indicating that call forwarding is now enabled. Now, to disable call forwarding, we're back at the home page, and with call forward highlighted, you're going to hit select. All right, now you see the option to enable the number and presets. With enabled highlighted, you're going to hit change. And as you noticed, the light went from red to green, and now call forward is disabled. And here's a pretty cool added benefit of the call forwarding application. If a user is unable to answer the phone call on the call forwarded number, the voicemail will be saved on the original destination so the voicemail won't get lost on a forwarded number once the user returns to their desk. And that's call forwarding. I hope this video helped. Thanks for watching.